small town girls living in Illinois. They're going anywhere. They're going anywhere. I think I'm first. Oh, I'll go first. I, I did last oh, okay. one. That's how it works. Next up, we have Catherine from Shawano County. Stylist, chic, and fashionable. She. She. <laughs> she. Say she. Stylist, chic, and fashionable. Catherine's wool coat is one to remember. The coat features inset pockets, a purple lining, and a trendy peacoat style. Catherine will be a junior at, Sh junior at Shawano Community High School in the fall. When not sewing, Catherine enjoys taking photographs and spending time with her family in Shawano County. She is a member of the Wisconsin 4-H Youth Theater Council. In high school, Catherine plays the alto saxophone, piano, and clarinet. She enjoys playing tennis in the fall and running the distance events in track and field. Catherine is active with Future Business Leaders of America, Student Council, Tri-M, and SABD Club. When not busy, Catherine likes to help out in her community and logs over 100 hours of community service every year. There you go, Catherine. Next up, we have Jewel from Washura County. Jewel Brooks will look absolutely stunning wherever she goes in this beautiful pink dress with a wraparound skirt and black lace. She combined two patterns to make it exactly the way she wanted, any way she wants it. She made it. With a sweetheart neckline and a high-low skirt, when Jewel isn't sewing fabulous dresses, she enjoys cooking and music and participates in many 4-H projects, including rabbits, foods, shooting sports, air guitar, air piano, and photography. She especially enjoys participating in plays with her 4-H club, having a chance to perform as Wendy in Peter Pan, Grace in Emmy, Snow White in Snow White, and the several small persons. That's like me. You're a short person. I'm a small You're a small person. person. Yeah, you can be in that play. You can be in that play. And this Wednesday, Wednesday, on this very stage, she will be Athena and Agamemnon in the hysterical history of Troy. Yeah, a couple of those. We wish her the best of luck this fall as she pursues a career in computers and design.